I feel like Ellenville as a town, it doesn't have that kind of, I guess you could say, spark that it had so many years ago. Be all your love now. Cause for all we know, we might be dead by tomorrow. And I think Ellenville School is kind of what makes Ellenville what it is now. I can't go on wasting my time Adding scars to my heart Cause all I hear is I'm not ready now My name is Alan Martinez, 17-year-old, 17 uh, 17-year-old 17 senior, right. here at Ellenville High. Hey, how you doing? Good. Uh, what's your name? Eben Nettles. Uh, Janelle Russell. Janelle Russell. My name is Tyree Rubin. Hey, Tyree. Nice to meet you. 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 Nice to uh, sports really like soccer, track, art, and Spanish. I do cross country, I do uh, basketball, and uh, this year I will be joining spring track. I play in a lot of sports. I take studio and art at the end of my day. Um, I take studio class. Well, I don't take studio class, but I'm like a part of it. I do the announcements in the morning. And yeah, that's it. It's like, as a junior, which is one of the hardest years in high school, you do like a lot of things that are like really difficult classes, and I take like chemistry and junk, and that's like really tough stuff, and it's like classes like this are not only like a stress reliever, but it's like I can find different ways to express myself. And so next year I'll be a senior and I'll be graduating, and I know that it wouldn't affect me, but I know a lot of younger athletes that are playing and that are looking forward to being like on the JV and varsity teams. And uh, it would suck to see them not be able to play and like enjoy the sports how I did. And yeah, that, that's a sucky thing, especially because I'm such a huge part of the sports here. I, I just don't think it's fair. I think that cutting something that and it's been around for so long to take it away now I, I just don't think it's fair I think that a lot of students hear about it and they want to do it one day and then to just take it away is just it's not fair I mean it would just ruin the whole real high school experience you would because you won't be able to do the things that you really want to do you know like you would just be stuck to like normal old English history math you wouldn't get to do the things that like you actually like to desire to do, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's just like a big help. It just like it's a way that we can express ourselves and also do something productive like this video itself. Like this is to get our fair funding and you know save the studio and stuff like that and our save our art program, save our sports. Like without the studio, we wouldn't be able to get this message really across. It actually have no outlet to release my stress things would be a lot harder and I feel like my grades would suffer because of it. I like it because you could just have a teacher help you with anything like have hands-on doing stuff instead of like just doing classwork and having to think about other things that so you could just make like anything like video Why do you guys like her? Because she's your favorite teacher. Is she really nice? Yes. Why do you guys think we need to keep our teachers? Um, so they can teach. And what else? And um, you can the math. Um, like we can do homework every weekend, but I don't like when we're off. I like this. I like my teachers.
We can't wait to grow. We can't wait for people to change our lives. We can't wait for opportunities beyond our wildest imaginations. We can't wait for a priceless and enriched education. We can't wait for all the essential components of an education that we undeniably deserve. We can't wait for the people who inspire us, the experiences that make us who we are, and the knowledge that enlightens us. We can't wait for the journey that prepares us for our futures. We can't wait to discover our passions. We are not numbers. We are students and individuals who cherish our years of school. Save our education because Ellenville can't wait.